what we're trying to do here is get a uh, get a little bit of lead with the outfielder. And when you do this, unless you're perfect, you you you'll hit a ball away a little bit. And right now, I've been hitting very much lately. Go ahead, go go go. And I just try to lead him a little bit like that. And go ahead and go. And just try to extend it. Try to extend it. And also, you introduce a little bit of sliding catches in here sometimes if you, that's good. Okay, there you go. That's it. That's it. That's what I want right there. One more round. We'll do it right this time. Go ahead. Take off. Take off. Take off. There you go. Go ahead. Okay, I got the feel of it now. I've been hitting the ball a little bit too firmly. Okay. One more round here of this, and then we'll uh, go ahead. You're just trying to lead out there like that. Go ahead. Lead a little bit like that. Lead. Okay, one more time over the other way. Go, 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 go. I'm going to really try to lead you this time. Go, go, go. I'm trying to get the thing. Okay. Okay, this is, a, this is a, another part of the agility drills we're doing. You have them go in one direction. Yeah, the outfielders going one direction, hit them behind them, and then we're going to have them turn into the ball this time. That's it. And as long as they turn into the ball and come back to it, we're in pretty good shape. We get them hit in the right direction. That's it. Come back into it. That's it, that's it, that's it. Good job. What, the, what this is like is that you, you've either overrun the ball or misjudged it or the wind caught it or you couldn't see it and you readjust to a, a bad uh, situation. And if you played the outfield enough, you're going to get caught in this. Yeah, wind blowing, lose a ball in the sun, fall down. You have to regain your momentum, and if you can do it without panic, keep your eye on the ball, you're in pretty good shape. Okay, now Connor already did it, so I want you to try this time, turn away from the ball. Turn away, in other words, I'm going in the wrong direction here. I see the ball's going behind me, I'm going to turn away from it, come back into it, going. That's the quickest way to get to it. Some guys can't pick it up that way, but that's the best way if you can do it. All right, turn away, atta baby. That's good, that's good, that's what we want. That should have been caught. <laughs> Can't blame the fungo guy there. There you go, come back into it. What, what you're looking for from a coaching standpoint, and I think from an outfielding standpoint, is that, that they don't, the distance doesn't get greater. It, start, it should get less. In, uh, in one situation there, we saw the distance get greater when he started turning, which means you might not be able to turn away from the ball like that. 